Well, I didn't bring my tripod this morning. Come on. I didn't bring my tripod this morning because I wasn't expecting a baby, but we have a baby girl. <laughs> Look at her. She's a big girl. I don't know if she's got any more in there. I kind of was expecting twins out of her, but that is a big lamb. I'm thinking she's got more. She's pretty wide. Oh my goodness, what a gorgeous girl. Unbelievable. Well, she didn't get classroom yet, that's what I know. So here is the new Lammy and the other Lammies. I'm so enjoying. <laughs> enjoying the weather. Now we just have three Lammies to go. I would say that is Pirate's daughter. Mm -hmm. She has the X on the spot. Yeah. Good job, Mommy. Pirate's She's a big girl. I suppose we'll name her, what'd you say, Lily? Lily. What a cutie. All right, guys, don't mind my hair. It's uh, very windy up here today on the top of this hill, but I started on the ends for the high tunnel. I will explain to you what I'm doing. Uh, I think I'm gonna go up only that high. That's rough cut oak. I'm, I'm gonna create the doorway there so it'll match on the other side. I'm just not finishing it right now because of the wind. It's just so, so windy up here. But I think I'm going to leave the top and I'm gonna cover that part with plastic. That way in the summer, I can open that up and let good air flow in. Uh, and we will, I will be taking this plastic off and replacing it with a good piece of plastic. But I think this is a good solution. The doors, I'm gonna frame out. I have to get dimensional lumber for that, or treated lumber, I mean. Um, I'm gonna get a couple two by fours, I think. I'm gonna frame those out and I'm gonna make Dutch doors. And I'm just gonna cover it with the plastic as well so that it allows maximum amount of sunlight in. And I'm thinking that way, if I do the Dutch doors, I can leave the bottom closed and open the top in the summer, as long as it's not windy. If it's windy, I won't have doors. They'll be somewhere else, <laughs> but not here. Uh, the back wall will look identical to the front wall. And I'm going to take a Sawzall once I get this up and the plastic off. And I'll cut these edges over here off and make that round. So that's the game plan. I like how it's turning out so far. I need to get a longer self tapper to get this uh, two by four up to the frame but it's, it's pretty solid. It's pretty solid. So I'm gonna call it quits for today on that project because the wind is so bad. Harley, can you grab those four batteries? Here, hand me those two, cause I gotta take those two down to the barn. Can you, this one here, that's Caleb's. Can you take that to Caleb? And can you put this in where daddy's Dewalt stuff goes? Okay, and I'm gonna, sorry, you're really close, aren't you? charge okay see what I'm saying about the wind <laughs> a hairstyle is not conducive to this way <laughs> if I turn this way it'll blow it back there we go just goes back <laughs> windswept is fashionable all right, so the weather forecast for the next... Okay. The we... Hold this for a second. I can't, I can't go anywhere without my coffee. It's like an appendage to my body. There we go, that's a little better. So the weather for the next 10 days during daylight hours is above freezing. 
And only three of those days are in the 30s. The rest of them are in the 40s and 50s. Oh yeah, they were cuddling. Hold on one second, I gotta show you guys this. I told you guys before that these girls are best friends. So you can see they'll both, they'll all take care of the babies. Isn't that adorable? Those sisters just make my heart so happy. I'm going this way. Heck with this mud. Oh, I will show you these little buggers too. Show you what we've done in here. So in here, I did put up a little pen and we moved Freya in here as well. And Bridget's over there with Soli and Loki. So Bridget and Soli are gonna get bred to that buck that I'm bringing in this weekend. I gotta get rid of the skeleton of the pine tree. Don't look at that. But we did this because that way Freya is in a spot where she can kid and not be stressed out. And Danny's not viciously attacking anyone because she's good for that. She's, she's savage. She's in a pen. Yeah. And the hay bunk worked out great because it really is, I, I zip tied my pen right to the hay bunk and it's worked out great. These little guys are doing fantastic. Oh, you put it inside. They're two days old now. Well, when you see this video, I guess they'll be three days old, but at the time of the video, they're two days old. What are you doing, little man? You wanna come say hi? They are so adorable. Do you show them the new film, I mean? Mm, I did in the video earlier, but we're gonna go back and see her now. Oh, bing. Bing bing. Well, let's do it, butter. Yeah, you can see the little light spot clearly. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mom. Loving. So I was surprised, but not surprised, surprised, but not surprised to come out this morning and see our new addition. A little baby lamb. Uh, it is out of our girl Tulip and either Fozzie or Pirate is the father. We are kind of thinking that it's Pirate You're that is the dad. It. We're gonna come in here and see. You guys can see Strawberry too. Did you see Rose? Yeah. Here we go. Well let me turn you around she is how precious is she come on you can also pet. where are you going so we've decided to name her lily all of our ewes have flower names except for strawberry but technically strawberry is a plant so yeah. vanilla is a bean yeah. <laughs> vanilla are you a bean good job mommy one strawberry I love the spots. The spots will fade, so she'll just be, you know, the same color as her, her mom. Like her vanilla. Hi, Vanilla. Strawberry! Oh, hi, Vanilla. Vanilla is a camera hog. Yes, you are a camera hog, aren't you? Mm -hmm. It's okay. She's allowed to be. Where's your daughter? Oh, she's way over there on the other side. Of, she's way over there. Come on. Let's go. That's my coffee. That's my that's my coffee you're trying to drink. Vanilla is the biggest on, camera hog that's ever been. Come on. There you come. Good girl. She's oh, drink she's going right to nurse. Drink. She'll come. Hold on. Give her a minute. Are you going down under? Okay. Oh, she's in there. Strawberry. She said yes. That's nice. Hey, girl. Hi. Vanilla. <laughs> what a camera hog. What a camera hog. She's not letting you drink. Okay. Vanilla is ever the camera hog. She loves to be in the spotlight. There's a strawberry. So you're She's not gone. Who's just snuggling her? Like, literally. Thank you, Vanilla. I know. The trend of bubble tea. Mm. <laughs> Penny. Hey. When I think of bubble tea, this is what I think Penny. of. Yeah. 
uh, sheep Straw. crap and goat. and goat turds that's and what here. bubble tea that looks like to me <laughs> sorry if i've ruined your idea of bubble tea it's just do you guys like bubble tea like that's that's one of those things i just can't i can't do too futuristic for me i'm probably in danger no you're not i got what i wanted here comes the new baby oh there she goes she's quite strong she's beautiful okay she's a big girl too oh hi vanilla vanilla you're gonna have to like her she's gonna be your herd mate you're stuck. You're stuck with me. There's a strawberry. She was just being so sweet. I swear. I'm not lying. Mm -hmm. yeah. She just wants to go play. I know. Vanilla. I know you like it. There you are. Hi, sweet Lily. Oh, what's your run? Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Come here. Look at the deer. She's literally just snuggling up underneath me. So both of these girls will stay in our flock. What a beauty she is. My goodness. Hi. Mm -hmm. Both of these girls will stay in our flock um, as breeders. And we couldn't be more excited about it. Hi, are you very curious about me, huh? Oh, hi, sweet girl. Your ears are huge. Yeah, her sister's <laughs> ears are huge as well. So that's the excitement, guys. In the past three days, we've had twin bucklings. We had 11 piglets. I'm not sure if I mentioned that to you guys or not. We were thinking that she was done at 10. She started to grunt and act like she was done. So we left and we went up to the house and we came down later to do barn work and check on the piglets, right? And I said, Harley, let's check and see how they're doing. I said, count them because she had her headlamp on and it was after dark. I said, check and see if you see all 10. And she goes, 10, 11, 11? I counted them five times. Yeah, so I went in and I uh, counted each one, like laid hands on them, and there are 11. So after we left, she spit out one more. And currently, this is 24 hours later. I thought I heard a car. Anyways. Strawberry. Jeez, this wind. Anyways, 24 hours later, all 11 are doing great, so... I do hear a car. It wasn't just the wind. All right, folks. I'm going to sign off for today. I don't know if this wind is going to pick up or not on, on the camera. So we're going to sign off. I'm going to work more on the high tunnel project over the weekend. And yeah, I guess we'll see you guys in the next one. Can I say bye. Bye. bye.